Ah, uh, today we are in the kitchen. I'm about to cook it up because we're talking about meals that you want. You know, you're gonna have that special night, whether it's an anniversary, that date, Valentine's Day, whatever it is. What you eat directly affects uh, how you perform, even a couple of days beforehand. So we're gonna talk about the type of food you should be eating, the meal that you should have, and hmm, how to make it taste good. So today I'm gonna to go over a quick meal you can have for lunch or for dinner that can help you uh, get your good wood up so that you can uh, get your freak on or make love. Uh, hey, that's up to you. And hey, my name is Brian, AKA Uncle B. And for the past 23 years, I've been a men's performance coach with Good Wood. So today specifically, we're gonna talk about the foods you need to eat and why, how, you know, let's get a little pattern to what you should be doing so you're making sure that what you eat, the timing of your food is working for your performance. You want the food to work for you, not against you. And of course, if you like what you hear, go ahead and hit that like button, that subscribe button, that notification bell. Why haven't you done that yet? Sir, you sir, why haven't you done that yet? So that I can do what I'm supposed to do, which is break this down till it cannot be broken anymore. So let's talk about your goals. Let's talk about, you know, let's start with the end in mind. The goal is to have a strong, long-lasting erection so you can get in, enjoy yourself as long as you want to, have your nice little orgasm, and get back up when you're ready to. And so what you eat has a direct effect on your sexual performance, so we need to make sure you're doing it correctly. Just like eating right before swimming can cause you to cramp up, going ham on ham <laughs> right before sex, ah, it's, not a good, it's not a good look, fella, not a good look. Which is why the meals I'm talking about today are going to be plant-based. When you eat meat, it doesn't matter what kind of meat, ostrich, otters, oysters, <laughs> as long as it used to move, you put it into your body, it's going to slow down your blood flow, uh, especially we're talking about down there. So, uh, you know, it's just like a person who has lung issues. You shouldn't smoke. If you have erectile issues, uh, you should be avoiding meat. I'm not a chicken hugger and you're grown, so uh, do what you want to, but uh, yeah, pay attention. Also, you want your meal to be light in sugar and also salt. These two uh, powdery substances, not the, not the sugar butter, but these two powdery substances can mess up your, not only your blood pressure and send your blood pressure up, which is not great for your erections, or with sugar, it's gonna lower your testosterone, which is not great for your erections. And also the assumption is that, you know, you're gonna be making love in the evening. So uh, just remember that your testosterone levels go down during the day, just naturally. And also it takes your body a good three hours to digest food. That's a healthy digestive system taking down healthy foods. You don't wanna be stuffed while making love. And of course, you gotta make sure you're drinking that water all throughout the day. And of course, make sure you're uh, getting your good wood in at least uh, three times a day. If you're going to snack, make sure it's not sugary or salty. Uh, me personally, I happen to love cashews, but uh, even with the nuts, almonds, um, things like that, you don't take it too far. And of course, make sure it's unsalted. And the more days in a row that you're eating healthy, the better your erection experience is gonna be. That's just the way this is. Of course, you can take this and make this a lifestyle, then you never have to worry about it again. So a couple of things, if you're doing this for lunch or for dinner, just a slight variation. So if you're, you know, during uh, lunch, you may wanna go ahead and go with the smoothie. I had the, uh, the maca smoothie recipe in the last video, check that out. But if you're going with a smoothie, that's great during lunch. Later in the day, you may want to just stick with the water so you don't have a lot of extra sugar uh, going through your, your system that needs to be digested. And for this meal, we're going to be doing a lettuce wrap. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, this is going to be good. I'm going to be giving you alternatives throughout so you can, you know, switch it up, vary it up. Me, I'm used to doing the, the kitchen smorgasbord. Uh, yeah, you just go to the refrigerator. It's like, hmm, put this and put this and put this and put this. But we want to make sure it's the right food. All right, so we got these ingredients because of what they can do. So let's go ahead and start off with lettuce. It helps with blood flow to the penis and can help with erectile dysfunction. Red bell pepper, high in vitamin C, helps improve circulation, blood flow, and that can lead to more sexual frequency. Onion is an aphrodisiac. Andrew Tate has talked about eating three or four onions a day. Woo, that's a lot. <laughs> but hey, it increases testosterone, so <laughs> go for it. Oyster mushrooms, oh my. Hey, I like them because of the texture and 
you know, it adds a little oomph to any recipe. But the cool thing about this, it actually downgrades toxins in your system. And we are surrounded with toxins that mess with our system, our testosterone, etc. Get this in your life. Garlic contains a lot of different nutrients, including magnesium, which is great for your sexual health. And right here, we got some uh, red bell pepper cauliflower dip. Yeah, yeah, cauliflower is great. Use cauliflower dip, there's cauliflower rice. It helps balance hormones and gets rid of excess estrogen. Perfect for an erection. See, you put us all together, you got something working for you down there, sir. So here's how we're gonna put this all together. In a large bowl, you wanna to toss together all the different vegetables. You can add the vinegar in and then just stir. Now, it depends on you. You can go raw with this, this vegetables, or you can cook it up. I'm gonna one pot wok this. I'm gonna put everything together in a pot, put it all together, and you'll see in a second. And of course, you may wanna season it as you're cooking it, but make sure you're staying light on the salt. And when you're done, you take it all, you just take your lettuce wraps, Fill the center of each one with about a good one fourth of it. You can play around lettuce wraps. They sort of, you know, they're delicate a little bit. Add in your rice, add in the cauliflower dip. And to eat, just wrap it up and stick it in. Enjoy it, enjoy it. Instead of the lettuce wrap, you can use pita bread. You can also use different variations of lettuce wraps, whatever works for you. Now, when it comes to having this for dinner, once again, this is a light meal. This is something that's light. It gets into your system. You can digest it quickly. If you're uh, eating this during dinner time, you want to, you know, don't go with any heavy drink. You just want to go with water. And this will set your body up for that good love making. Now, this is just one meal. Obviously, there are thousands of meals out there that are plant-based. I'm suggesting to you, if you have issues, go ahead and start looking at that. I know it took me whew, a good two, three years to get away from uh, having meat every day of the week. <laughs> and so now, uh, yeah, it's, it's good. There's some flavor to it. Experiment. And of course, the other things are still in play. We're talking about you can't have the alcohol. It's just a poison that happens to make you feel woozy. And everything else I mentioned in here, of course, giving your body time to digest the food, avoiding the salts and the sugars and the extra snacks. This is all going to lead to more blood flow, more testosterone, less inflammation in your body, and a better night making love. Hey, and that's all I got, except to the part where I cook and eat. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Mmm. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, right here. Healthy. Put down here. Light. Gives you energy. Use this one, guys. Use this one. So, fellas, enjoy that. I'm going to enjoy mine right now. And this is your Uncle B saying, get your game up and go hard. Peace out.